what is up everybody this is Ken from KOC Vlog. Today we're unboxing the Royal Clutch G87 gaming keyboard. Primarily this keyboard is used by gamers, for gamers, and for our intensive purposes, or actually my son's purposes, as far as online schooling. Now due to the global pandemic that's been going around right now, online schooling has been quite the trend. Uh, among other things needed, you need a pretty good laptop and some other accessories like a light and now he needs a keyboard. So without further ado, let's get to unboxing this thing. Right. Now this is a very unassuming box. It's just an orange and black box. Uh, there's some shipping damage of course and that's actually due to the courier and that's really not any other fault of our own. So you know, nothing much here in the back. PC code right here. And here he is. G87 Dual. Uh, G87 Dual Mode uh, Gaming Keyboard. Alright, the models we've got are is equipped with the RK branded brown mechanical switches. So, let's open the box. Alright, inside the box, we've got the keyboard that reads it right away. Pull it out. You've got a Ziploc baggie with a keycap puller and the USB Type-C cord. You've got a rubber replacement rubber feet. All right. And we've got the user manual. Now it's important that you read this user manual because a lot of the instructions here are important to the functions of the keyboard, including carrying the Bluetooth and uh, operating the lights. Here's the box. There's the box. Put it aside. And let's take out the keyboard. Alright, here we've got the keyboard. Uh, it's Royal Clutch's 10 keyless design. What do we mean by that? That means the number pad that's usually here on the right side is not there anymore. That makes for a more compact design so it takes up less space on your desk. Uh, it's a pretty decently hefty board. It weighs about maybe 400 grams, so it doesn't slide around on your desk like normally over here, so it doesn't slide around on your desk. Okay, the key caps are in a DSA profile height, that means that they're decently high, it makes for a more comfortable typing experience. Alright, next let's take a look at the other side. Uh, you have the uh, channels there for your USB Type C card. USB Type-C slot over here, power switch for your Bluetooth connection, and the rubber feet that you've made to replace. On the sides, we have uh, side pods here. If you notice the design, these side pods are RGB enabled. Now, later on in the video, we'll turn on the lights, but for now, let's just go through the features of the keyboard. Among other things, key switches, which are Royal Pledge's brown switches, they're similar to Cherry MX Browns, that they're tactile, there's a slight bump there when you press down on them. The actuation is pretty early on, before the key actually bottoms out. So, a little word of warning, if you haven't used a keyboard in a long time, like I have, it may take, you may make a few typing mistakes along the way. Alright, now for the moment everyone's been waiting for, as you can see, the lights are dimmed down, that only means one thing, turn on the lights. There we go. So, all right, uh, here's the here are the side pods on the G87. The wonderful RGB side pods, as you can see, it gives you a nice side glow on your on your desk. And the power on sequence is a really neat thing too. Let's power this on. Three, two, one. There we go. All right, rainbow goodness for everybody. So, this is a pretty standard fair RGB. You have controls for speed of the effect, brightness of the RGB. It's bright. It's dim down the lights. There we go. We can change the effect here with the print screen, scroll lock, and pause keys. Scroll lock to cycle through the effects. And then, right, 
the left arrow to increase or decrease the speed. Left and right arrows. There we go. Faster. Slower. The pause button to lock it to one color. And the insert key to change the color on the side box. Let's put that to the side first. There we go. Turn it off. And on again. Alright, typing field on this keyboard is very, very well decently packed by using RK's brown switches. They feature a little fact, uh, a slight bump before you're pressing down on the keys. Unlike the, the blue switches which are very clicky or the red switches which are very linear which means to be more, much much smoother. Now for gaming purchase purposes I guess this is okay. I haven't really gamed in a while I'm just basing everything on experience of hyping on this thing. So Let's listen to a few typing sounds, alright. Space bar. Enter key. Backspace. Tab. Shift. Decently loud. Not annoying. Okay, that just about wraps up our unboxing of the Royal Clutch G87 keyboard. Here. If you wish to purchase this keyboard, it's available on Shopee and Lazada. I'll provide some links below for everybody to follow. This has been Ken from KSA Blog, and until next time, peace out.